Hello, it's me again. Now, I am here to tell you about something we got in the mail. Which is not out here. Why don't you give it to me so I can put it out here? One second. There you go. All right, see, now, back a couple of years ago, like literally years ago, I backed the Kickstarter project for All Things Must Pass, the Tower Records uh, documentary that was done by uh, Colin Hanks and uh, Russ Solomon. Um, now, th- one of the rewards was for backing was you get a record. You get a record. Uh, this is a really sweet, snazzy little record, right? Um, it's like it's like really thick. It's like a 180 grain vinyl, um, and it's signed by Colin Hanks and Russ Solomon, who's like the guy who like created Tower Records. Good man. Um, you know, for for those of you who have seen my Tower Records special, I did like a while ago. Of, like I actually did a review of the movie. I'm finally just getting the rewards now. Like like. This was funded in 2013. It is now 2016. Three years. So, come on. Um, so, yeah, we got the vinyl. Um, it's, it's very nice. And get it out because I, I, got, I, do have so, I do have something to complain about. And you're going to have to get it. Move this. Get the other thing. All right. Now, here's my complaint. Okay. No, no, okay, the other thing was, like, you could get a signed thing by, like, you know, oh, you know, Russ Solomon, Colin Hanks, and, you know, they signed a movie, and they send it to you, um, which, which is very good, and I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm congratulating them for, you know, getting the rewards out in a three-year time span, um, which was kind of cool, you know, I didn't have to wait too long, but here's, here's my problem. When this was signed... They signed the plastic case, not the artwork inside the case, not not the insert, which there was none, not the disc itself. They signed the plastic. They signed the plastic. Now, for a collector of weird things, it's kind of important that you sign the artwork and not the plastic case, which is there to protect the artwork. Okay, now bring yours out. You actually did something right. Bring it out. Uh, all, right, all, right, all right, all right, See, now what this guy did, right? This guy went the extra mile. He took, when he did his Kickstarter, he took all the artwork out of every single DVD and he signed it in archival ink, put it back in its protective case, and then sent it out. Okay? That is what he did. It took a lot of time, but he did it. He made that extra effort. So you know what? If your case breaks, guess what? You can replace it and still have your artwork completely signed by uh, whatever his name is, and Dawn Bennett, okay? That is what he did. This, your case breaks, you're done, okay? You're going to be storing broken pieces in a little plastic bag wishing it was the actual out- artwork that was signed, okay? Wrong, okay? Colin Hanks, listen to me. You do not sign the plastic, you sign the artwork, you know, like, like when artists sign pictures, they don't sign the glass on the frame, okay? You get what I'm saying? You don't sign the glass frame. You sign the artwork. I, I'm sorry. It was just, I'm very angry about that. No, I'm sorry. I'm very angry about that. And, and you know, the movie was good. I enjoyed it. If anyone's seen the review I did, you go watch it, you know, and, and relive life. But... You know, all that aside, it was, it was a successful Kickstarter. The movie was good. This is just... You notice how he, he actually signed the actual album 
You know, the 45 has got a signature on the sleeve. Okay, good. You didn't sign the black vinyl part, right? Yeah. Any, anyway, so th- this kind of bugged me because it's now on plastic. And if they use, God forbid, if these guys used a Sharpie marker, that is going to yellow over time. It's not, ar- not ar- archival ink, like the silver marker you used. Good job. And it's going to just be hell. Okay, so this might as well be burned alive. Because it is nothing you can keep and pass on to future generations who may want to know what a Blu-ray was. So, yeah, get it out of here. Okay, bring yours back. Okay, see, you sign the artwork. Damn, dude, look at, look at, look at those boobs, man. That is, those are huge. They're like the size of her head. I know your eyes are going right there. I know everyone's eyes are going right there. Come on. I know it's part of the psychological bullshit you were going through, but still, I mean, come on. No one's thinking that. No one's like, oh, she must have a warped self-image, and that's why she's perceiving herself like that. No, nobody's thinking that. They just see boobs. You're, you're overestimating your audience. He overestimates his audience. Like his, like all, like everyone is going to be all, you know, thinking it on on billions of li- people want to be entertained, and I, I keep telling him that. But yeah, he does sign the actual artwork and not the plastic you would throw away. So good for you. All right, I'm I'm done. I'm going to calm down. Like I said, I appreciate the work that that everyone did on that documentary, but that little bit of effort, which I know is a lot of effort. Because you take you take apart 200 DVDs and you sign all them and put the artwork back in, it is a lot of work. Believe me, I know. Okay, but make the extra effort and and give something to people that they will, you know they can hold on to, and not worry about the the everything getting damaged. You know, don't sign the glass is what basically what I'm saying. All right, can we end this now? I'm just, it was just, it was eating away at me. It was eating away at me. I had, I had to express, you know? I still haven't listened to that record yet. Can you put it in my box when you put me away? What do you mean you don't have a record player? I thought you were a hipster. Oh, well, all right, whatever. He's, he's got a semi-working record player. Uh, I, I don't like vinyl either. What a, get it out of here. Maybe just keep the boobs in screen. All right, now leave the boobs there. No, hold on. Now, now I get too much reflection. All right, we'll just we'll put the boobs here. Okay. All right. See, see when you when you work on a cartoon uh, character design, keep this in mind because this is all that people are focusing on. They don't care about the psychological ramifications of society and how people are perceived. I know that's the point. See, that's the point. That's what he's, uh, whatever. No one cares. All right, I'm done. I'm out. You get back to work. Everyone live life. Uh, Don't sign the glass.